Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I rise in support of H.R. 1713, the DOE and USDA Interagency Research Act. This bill allows the Department of Energy and the Department of Agriculture to work together to improve how we grow our food, fiber, and fuel in America. As a farmer and rancher myself, I'm proud to sponsor this bill, which will help us address cross-cutting research challenges that will advance crop science, maximize carbon storage, enhance precision agricultural technologies, and more. DOE and USDA already have a successful track record of collaboration to mitigate invasive species, to modernize the grid, address the energy water nexus, develop biofuels, and improve agricultural operations. DOE has some of the country's most advanced computing capacities, as well as world-class research facilities and a depth of scientific expertise. These resources can be used to support the work being done by America's farmers and ranchers, ultimately strengthening our agricultural production. The bill before us today is smart, bipartisan legislation that codifies the partnership between DOE and USDA, ensuring they can continue to work together on these interdisciplinary challenges. I want to thank my ranking member, Zoe Lofgren, for working with me on this legislation and helping to pass it through the Science Committee with unanimous support. I appreciate her support of agricultural research, and I urge all of my colleagues to join us in supporting this bill. I reserve the balance of my time, Mr. Speaker. As we've heard, H.R. 1713, the DOE and USDA Interagency Research Act is smart bipartisan policy to make it easier to address the agricultural research challenges facing our nation. By passing this bill, we are supporting the science and technology that will enable easier production agriculture. Once again, I'd like to thank Ranking Member Zoe Lofgren for her support of this critical issue. I urge all my colleagues to join in supporting this bill, and I yield back the balance of my time, Mr. Speaker.